Hi everyone, this is Julia from Green Umbrella and I'm just going to talk you through the new designed Twitter application, which I actually love. I think it's great. Um, so first of all, let me just start by just going through some basics. Um, they've changed the icon right at the very top, so the little square um, is not quite the same as it was before. So that's actually to write a brand new tweet, literally just tick the quill that you've got there so you can create um, a tweet. You can actually go live directly from uh, there if you really want to you can add your gifts you can see um, your statistics or oh, sorry do a poll statistics what am I on about um, obviously you can check in as in not check in but it does like tear to various different locations which I think is great okay so that's literally just from there and don't forget as well you can add up to four images uh, to add an extra image you just go add okay and then down here bottom left you just click to add your next one. And you can add up to four images. Also, don't forget that you can also add descriptions. So if I click on a description, I can add up to 420 extra characters. Uh, and it's, these are all indexed by Google because these are actually alt tagging. That's exactly what they're doing. I'm just going to cancel that now. Uh, the other thing I you know you can do, you can have been able to do this for a long, long time, is you can add stickies. Um, so if I just add hearts, uh, and I can do that and move those around, make them smaller or bigger. There you go. Okay, right, let's just cancel that um, and cancel that. So that's the first thing I wanted to show you. The second thing, so obviously the icons changed, that's the new thing. Okay, let's work down the bottom. So the home is still the home, um, that's no problem there. The explore button is fairly new, but I'll quickly show you that what that is as well. So if I click on the explore button, um, okay, so you, sometimes they've been showing live streaming. So when the fire happened in London, there was a live stream that was happening there, which is fantastic. So you can just click on and have a listen. Um, but obviously that's not there today. Um, you've got what's trending. So these are the UK trends. Um, you can't change the you can't change it to like a location, which you can on the desktop version uh, from here. Um, then you've got moments, which are just underneath. So I tend to have a look quick look and see what moments are actually trending right now and then underneath I always click on fun because these are always good things to share as well onto your tweets just to get you know a bit of extra exposure okay so that's the second button so in here we've got explore and we've got trending news okay so the next one is your notifications so we've just changed the symbols the symbols just look a little bit new so all your notifications are in there you can see who's mentioned you in a tweet and you can see all notifications and then the last one is not write a, a tweet it's actually your direct messages i won't show you those but that's the direct messages there okay now if you put your finger on and you swipe right okay this is the thing that i think is absolutely fantastic now you can click here and you can swap accounts so that's my green umbrella account Okay, so I get notifications for Green Umbrella. You know, I get my, um, I can explore, I can see my direct messages. Okay, if I swipe right again, I can, that's uh, Recruitment Supermarket, which is another uh, company that I own. I need to put in the password for that one. <laughs> uh, and then back on to Julia. So it's so much easier just to go onto different accounts. So again, I'm going to uh, click on actually there this is something else that they're showing in case you missed it i love these and they're also showing figures which they didn't before so you've got figures next to how many favorites that's had how many comments that's had which actually i think is quite a, a cool thing so well done twitter on the numbers like that okay so just going down the moments here are not um you know well-known moments these are actually your moments so anything in this side when you've swiped right is all to do with you so you've got your profile your lists and your moments okay so one of the things most people know that i do every single day is i click on lists and then i like to have a look at my lists i check out my competitors but i also check out my top recruitment peeps and then i can interact just with that list which I think is great and it's nice and easy to do now on the old mobile phone. So that's something I really do like. So thank you very much to Twitter for that one. Back to your list. Just to show you how to add somebody to a list on the app. 
Uh, let's just pick somebody. I've no idea who this person is. So I've gone into the profile. You see this little button just up here, this down drop. Okay. Um, oh, no, did that wrong. Sorry, going into the profile. And then you click on that little icon. So this little cog here. And then I can add or remove from lists and I can add her onto any of my lists that I, I want to. Okay. Not really sure what that is. Allow Twitter to send you push notifications in settings. Not now. Okay. I thought that was for an individual. I didn't haven't seen that before, so but it's not. That's just for general notifications. Okay, so that's all like a whistle tops uh, like a, a, a look and see what's happening in the world of Twitter. So that's me done for today. Hopefully you like that and I'll see you next week. Take care. Bye bye.